Bingo Man. Terry Bingham is known as a giver. Okay, let me get you one. Like offering advice to customers at the Warwick Hobby Store and Plantation where he works. But this dad was given something he didn't expect over a decade ago. His little girl, then two years old, was sick. I really didn't notice that I had anything. Elisa's memory almost as faded as the scar on her neck. For dad, the mental scars remain. ALL, acute lymphatic leukemia, which is one of the easiest to cure, but still, as a parent, it's, it's a shocking thing to learn. He learned what he could about the disease, even at work. Meanwhile, dealing with the effects of countless medicines. About three days before Christmas, uh, she lost all her beautiful blonde hair on my pillow. Doctors told Bingham his daughter's chances looked good, saying part of the treatment ran through dad's veins. Her red cell counts were not coming back. And I asked her, I said, what is my daughter's blood type? She told me, and I said, hmm, that is very interesting. She says, what do you mean? I said, mine's identical. 14 years later, Elise, who spends a lot of time with her dad at the hobby shop, is getting ready to graduate high school next year. An oncologist here at Memorial Hospital West says it is the ultimate gift you can give somebody giving blood or being a part of the National Bone Marrow Registry. To sign up for the registry and to be a donor simply involves swabbing the mouth. Bingham was a very rare match, doctors say, but he knew someone was looking out. God put a miracle there, and my daughter's blood counts have hardly ever changed ever since then to this day. It's pretty amazing that like I'm still here right now. But she is, telling me she hopes one day to return the favor to someone else. In Plantation, Jim Robinson, CBS4 News.